Guys, welcome <clears throat> to the number one place to get better at League of Legends. I am Nice, and if you're watching this on YouTube, uh, did you know that 99.9999% of you are already subbed, except for just one person, and that's you, and I hope that you get hit by a bus. Mask, not like me, like masculine dudes, big, big schlongs. Anyways, coaching of I, <clears throat> wait, uh, yeah, coaching of I, I'm going to teach you guys how to play Vi better, um, or just how to play tempo junglers better because, uh, I don't think people often understand the, you know, what the fuck you're supposed to be doing. Um, and yeah, we've got a guy in gold. Let's get some LP. I'm going to be coaching all day today, uh, minus the private coaching that I have. So we're, we're busy today. Yeah. What up? Sorry about the delay. How's it going? What's all up? Right. It's, uh, it's what? What'd you I say? Just, can you hear me all right? Yeah, yeah you're good. Okay. One correction, because I just listened to your intro. Okay. I don't play Vi jungle. I play Vi mid. Oh, you play Vi mid. Oh, yeah. I see it. I see it. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We could do that. Yeah. Um. Cool. That works. Um. Let me see here. Which account's the most active one? The Bitmex one or the other one? Um. The the kind of equal at this point, I'd say. Okay. What's your so goal with the I game did, while I'm looking this up? I. I have been playing this game for a long time and I just want to be better at what I have fun doing. Okay. There's not a specific goal. I just like, I like using my brain and I want to be able to like, think about this game in a more interesting way and get better at it through that process. Um, okay. Do you have a, a like a rank goal? No, not necessarily. I mean like, you know, ranking up is cool, but I don't have a specific goal in that regard. We're going to peek the recent loss and see what exactly your laning looks like or just how you move. Um, sure. I can get this to load, please load. Wait, if this is the game against the Vigar, that's probably not the good one, a good one to watch because the pike just like fed me randomly in lane. Like, oh, I'm talking about the loss. Are you talking about the yeah, loss? Yeah, that was a loss. That was a loss. That was a loss. Oh, uh, what do you mean fed <laughs> you like? He, he walked in the lane and walked into me and then walked into my tower. Yeah, but you still lost, right? Yeah. Okay, um, sure. Yeah. <laughs> whatever works, whatever works, man. I mean, if whatever you still works. lost, uh, <laughs> it oh, doesn't really not matter. That game. Okay, it's okay, not okay. that game, so it's fine. It's fine. Hmm. All right, let's see what you do here. So you guys had the definitively stronger, uh, at least in my opinion, definitively the stronger level one, and none of you pinged for an invade at all, which I'm not a huge fan of, if I'm being honest. Um, the rationale being that uh, that you're basically missing value, right? Like, so league is a league is a game that when you are ahead, you the game like the test is or whether or not you've passed or failed is whether or not you tried to leverage your mo like your advantage at any like okay. basically as soon as you were stronger did you try to do something with it right that test starts at zero minutes zero seconds so normally when i get clients now and i guess this is just korea uh updates that i've had to my personal game is i just go do we do we win right now because if we do i ping it and i start trying to lead the invade so why do you think or why do you think that i'm saying that you win level one based on these champions um we have a lot more cc so we can yeah. lock someone down and get a get a kill right and you know i look at this comp as like you know the scariest part that they have or the scariest thing that they have is a cho'gath which i'll grant mm -hmm. you if he does happen to hit a q that kind of stinks but i would argue that when you have Karthus, Karthus is just like an S tier champion and an S tier level one. Mm -hmm. And okay. the reason he's an S tier level one is because he kind of operates in the same logic of Scion, where it's like, even if he somehow loses early, his he's passive is high value. Yeah. yeah. So okay. if you're not trying to leverage uh, level ones when I basically, if you want to, if you want to wow me on a random loss replay and no one's ever done this, by the way, you know, you have to pass these various little tests, like at the beginning of losses, right? And one of those tests is like, did you silently sit there with a Morgana Karthus and not try to invade? If the answer is yes, then you fucked up. Hmm. Okay. Right? If you didn't ping it. Now, if you pinged it a couple times and walked at the enemy team, then I would look at the VOD and I would go, okay, you tried to make your team do something. 
and you were right so that you know they they are noobs because they're not leaving base that's not your fault do you see where i'm going with this so it's almost like yeah. just because no one's watching you doesn't mean that you don't try to do the right things well, what are we doing with the wave here what, what, what did you think you were doing with the wave just now out, out of curiosity um with my initial hits yeah um i because I took Q first, um, I like to try and get that level advantage because in my mind, like my E is what the value actually comes from in lane. Um, and it's the ability to both farm and poke from a distance. So let's talk about so that. I so yeah, I agree. I, I get the premise of pushing, but my whole thing is I want you to just so you, just so you know, once you've autoed it like twice, you can just guard. You don't have to touch okay. the minions anymore, um, is what I'm trying to get at. So, like, you keep autoing them, mm -hmm. and you're just pushing faster than you need to, because what I always tell people, it's good that you're pushing, absolutely. And if he's not in the wave, that's that's good. But I yeah. want to show you something. He's so clearly not paying attention to his lane. So you've autoed, like, four times, right? He's autoed zero times, right? So from here to here... This is your time to score, right? I talk about offense, defense. When you yes. when you throw out unnecessary hits on the wave, these are unnecessary because no one's touching the wave but you. When you throw out unnecessary hits on the wave, you shorten that distance. So that distance becomes more like this. Like the amount of times the amount of times that you can rattle off a full rotation of Q into auto auto or whatever. Um, you can only do that so many times because you've pushed so fast. Um, uh -huh. I'm just l letting you be aware of that because if you don't understand why you're pushing, that's a problem. Now, thankfully, in this lane, Cho'Gath Q is kind of balancing out your push a bit because it's AoE. You'll see what I mean uh -huh. here in a second if he does it again. Right there. If it hit all three minions, that does kind of, that does kind of uh, equate to the same amount of auto attack damage that you did. But you see how you have three range creeps up on this push? Yeah. Ideally, you'd want like one. Okay. You see what I mean? Because it like, it slows this down and gives you more time to play. Okay. Because if we're uh, on offense, we want to be on offense for as long as possible. That's what I'm trying to teach you. Let's talk about this so you can understand back timing and then we'll go into a couple games. So why is this bad? Everybody would probably be wondering, like, why am I saying that he's fucking his tempo up? Well, the reason has to do with where we kill this dude, actually, um, and how we kill him. So <clears throat> are we on offense or are we on what? Well, let me back up a bit. All right, here we go. Are we on offense or are we on defense? I would say this is defense. I would say it's even, so you're close. Okay. So the wave has equaled. You understand? It met right in the middle. Okay. Even, wait, hold. Even considering that my minions will lose if I do not touch the wave more than he does? Okay, so yes, he did cue it, but my point is, is that he just used an ability he has nothing. Mm -hmm. At this moment, at this exact moment, I, we're kind of splitting hairs a little bit, but the point that I'm more trying to get you to understand is that when you choose this fight the playing field is dead even okay that's what i'm trying to say yes he hit the minions and fucked with them a little bit and, and established a minor push but that doesn't change anything right now yet unless you'd fallen back completely you're still able to answer what he used his abilities on and in this case it's an all-in right that's what you wind up doing but my point is is that right now we're in the middle of the lane dead center Right now, that's significant because if we kill him and the wave's dead center, that means that we now have to push the wave from the center of the lane to the tower. Right? Okay. Does that make sense? So, like, yeah. If you had killed him, let's remove this wave. Pretend it doesn't exist. Okay. So we Thanos snap. Yeah. This wave's gone. And now you all in this guy right here, and then you take a plate. Now I'm okay with it. Because you didn't have to manage the wave after killing him. You see where I'm going okay. with this? So if the wave um, is like already shoving out or almost pushed in and then you get the kill, you were on offense when you got the kill, which means it's a huge win. Killing somebody with the wave equal is still a good win, but it's not a huge win. Okay. 
So, so your hypothetical scenario is like obliviously offense, but what I'm confused of, or is, is offense defense based on like the wave's position, the wave's potential position, the champion position? Because I've watched a lot of your videos and I thought I was gonna understand it, but now I'm lost. Okay, so you're basically I confused you a little bit by by saying that the wave is equal. The idea is yeah. that he had used his abilities on the wave as soon as you guys yeah. arrived, right? That yes. leaves you an opportunity to go in. For the purposes yes. of discussion, you guys, this is long beyond like early levels. You guys have all in potential and all sorts of stuff that you can do. The key here is understanding that you both roughly arrive to the wave at the same time. So you're still battling for offense or defense. That's what I'm trying to say. Okay. It's still a fight. You At the beginning of the game, let's change it here just to make sure you're more clear on it. At the beginning of the game, I'm on offense. Like, I'm clearly on offense because no one can ever touch me here. Yeah. Right? He can't do anything about Like, he could cue it from range, but I could just auto and keep position. Now, let's fa fast forward to when you all in this guy. Okay, so now watch this. So you come to lane and guess what? Yes, he's pushing, but it's not the yes. same. You can now fight yes. him. He he can't just he can't just push and like you have to respect it. Because the wave is roughly equal and mm -hmm. he doesn't have the capability of defending this wave with what he just yes. did. The problem what broke his offense. The problem was he just opens Q and misses instead of yeah. just simply saving his abilities and hitting the minions. That's what I'm mm -hmm. trying to say. He mm -hmm. gives you an opportunity to contest it. And so mm -hmm. it's very, very clear that it's like, wait, like I could just go here and fuck with him. Mm -hmm. And I've established yeah. offense. So the minute that you do this, watch. It yeah. doesn't matter what the fuck it is. Yeah. Does okay. that make sense? Yes. Okay. Because, I mean, yeah, like I said, I, I, I've uh, jammed it up a little bit, like, vocabulary-wise. But, like, the premise that I'm getting after here is just be aware of the fact that at this particular moment when you go for an all-in, it's not like you're on definitive offense or definitive defense or anything like that. The wave is roughly equal when you're going for this all-in. Because technically, like, you can win on defense. You, you obviously... Sh will usually win on offense but you can mm -hmm. win like if the wave is like huge and pushing mm -hmm. you could theoretically win now what mm -hmm. the fuck do you do after you win Ah, eh, you would normally like think to freeze or like clear the wave and back so it's mm -hmm. similar concept here so you get the kill mm -hmm. and now you're in a fucky spot because it's like well i killed him but my wave's kind of pushing but not great so i've got to mm -hmm. like get this wave under and then you feel like you have to do something with it. But in reality, you should just press B right in the middle of the lane right here. That's why it's a little... It, that's why this game is hard. Is because there's just so many like situations where it's like, you killed the guy, you should ask yourself, did I kill him with the wave pushing? Did the, Was the wave like pulling to me? Is the wave like in the middle? Um, that determines the, the, the length of time that you have to push and do stuff. Most okay. of your time was spent pushing a wave. So it was somewhere like here. We had about this much time to do stuff. Does that make sense? Uh -huh. Yeah. And usually yeah, yeah, cool. that would be just a back because hit, well, like literally just watch what happens. If you had vision of the entire map, maybe you'd go for a plate. But even if I had vision of the entire map, I would probably not even feel too big about hitting this plate. And the reason why is because once you base... You have to come back to catch the wave. And depending on how fast your opponent is, it kind of fucks with things because if he's fast, he can push and roam now. The classic example would be like, you're facing a, uh, we'll say Jace, right? If you don't if you don't push this in quickly and, and leave, Jace is gonna run out of base with, with his E. He's gonna sprint out by uh, form swapping a bunch. He's gonna come out. He's gonna blast the wave before you can get to it, and then he's gonna run around the map for a second. You could avoid all that by as soon as you get that kill, you assess the wave and you go, "Okay, how fast is the push? All right, uh, goodbye. I I can't like I just push this and leave. 
right? Okay. Um, does that all make sense? I know that was kind of chaotic. Let's see right, here. Go ahead and show here. your screen. Go ahead and show your screen again. It bugged out. It's not I guess. Sharing? Oh shoot! It Hold just on. bugged out when it like loaded. I think. Okay, sorry. Uh, oh, you missed the whole ass thing. Um, oh, my bad. The whole ass no, thing. My bad. My bad. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you're full health, uh, or sort of full health. We'll just go for the quick recall. So yeah. you've got, uh, whoa, what's the new news? The new new griefing? Basically, what you missed here is oh, okay, Vigo and um, Victor started trying to invade. Press escape real quick I, and shrink your HUD size. That's, that HUD is like giving me anxiety. Uh, go to is, interface, interface on the left, yeah. Scroll up, and then there's the HUD at the top, and then just put it at zero. Put it at zero, trust. Yeah. Okay. There you go. A little better uh, visual I, real that, estate is all. Did that do anything? Okay, sure. Hey, you did it. You did it. All yeah. right. So what's oh, the what, what's oh, the matchup? The, yeah, uh, yeah. It's Victor, which is very hard for me. <laughs> no, just sit back. Sit back. Don't even walk up. Don't even walk up. Okay. You probably should have taken Q first, don't you think? Um, I take Q in very specific scenarios. But this would be the scenario. <laughs> Uh, champions that I oh, can I see, 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 I see. The shield has value. I got it. I got it. Yes, that exactly, makes sense. Exactly. That makes sense. That makes My sense. My passive is what I work around. Got it. No, that's fair. I, I like it now. I, I didn't. I yeah. brain like. Unless I can go like balls deep really early on like like level. No, that that makes total. That makes I total sense, it. dude. You're good. That's fine. Yeah, now that uh, I uh, I've yeah. forgotten about the shield on minions. I always forget about the shield on Vi. Yeah. It, it's very integral to her gameplay. Right. No, it's good. It's good uh, for surviving the harass. I see why you're doing it. All right, so mm -hmm. we just pull this back under tower. Yeah. And then I would look for a big trade on two. 100%. So, like, right here, I would just trade. Yep. That's an easy, easy money trade right there. That's actually a tap. Nice. Uh, wait, wait. This is the situation. Hold tap. Okay. Recall. Recall right now. Okay, why? Okay, you're gonna see. Watch. You're getting the XP right now. Yes. And he's gonna come forward. So you grab your long sword, Q out. Now look your move your camera forward. He's gonna push to you. Yes, you lose yes. a cannon. Yes. yes, I get that. But what you what you achieve is you keep your tempo. So when you get to the right. lane, you can now assist ping the fuck out of this. So assist ping the gank. Put the ping on Nunu's head and ping that this guy has no flash. Now just calmly farm, just like you were going to. You can't freeze it, obviously. But now, the wave is going to be pushing out again, and he's going to be inclined to walk up and poke you. See? Now you're full health. You can trade. Anytime he walks up, trade into him. Just so you know. Okay. Uh, I'm just, yeah. Now get ready to fucking obliterate him if he walks anywhere near the wave. Right. Yeah, do it up. Good. Now just slow push from here and guard. See, look, look. I love this. Okay, yes. Okay, yes. Okay. It's Here's happening. Vico. It's happening. You win. You win. You win. Turn. Kill. Kill this. I, I hate that you call him Vigo, but we're we're going with it. It's like the guy from uh, Ghostbusters. So. Uh, okay. <laughs> Time is but a uh, assist ping the shove or shove over. yourself. Either's cool. Either works, and it's, then recall. Fine, yeah, yeah, and then just recall, like queue away and recall. Make it, make it sexy. Yeah, you should have queued through the minion. Then it would have been sexy. Uh, yeah, okay, okay. That's. So you see, you see, it's happening. Okay. Things are happening now. Now you this can get Dirk. Goal. Yes, yes. I hate this. It's so small. Right, I know. I size mat. Like, what is this? Size matters, bro. I'm telling you, isn't it funny though? That that just a simple adjustment. <laughs> No, I'm talking about the the HUD. It's so small. Oh, I thought you were. I thought you were like you hate the adjustment of just like uh, backing at the right time. No, no yes. that's great. That's great. That's great. But but okay. All right. It is continue, a small change continue. too. I'll deal, I'll deal with it. It's a huge change. Yeah, that's. Right, uh, so continue. Continue. So this wave, what you would do is you would let it crash. Right. At least I would. I would let it go under tower. The main yeah. reason is because trading into him is just kind of messy. Yeah. Like you could right. trade into him, but then you have to like balance the wave. I'd rather just let it come under and then right. farm yeah. it all faster this way. Yeah. And then yeah, now, like yeah, now you could just chill. And then as soon as you spike six, you could just all in him 
Because again, he doesn't, he clearly doesn't know how wave management works because he keeps walking up. So if he walks up what? here, <clears throat> he's just dead okay. to rights. Yep, slow pushing guard, you're six. So if he goes anywhere near the wave, set up an all in. Right there, right there. Oh, you could have queued through he's, that. He's not, what? He's, he's not close enough. To I know, it would have been, like, it would have like, been kind of sus, but if you had walked forward, you could have, maybe you could have just walked forward and you wouldn't have to queue through. Like as you're turning six. <laughs> there it, you go, it. there you go. Hey, it, this works, I like it. Good job. Hey, All right, hard, hard job. Now this is a pretty good timing because your push is nice and fast. Right, we've got a pretty fast shove here. So we're just gonna push, use our Q, use our E, yep. Now you can auto, yeah, yeah, you can auto, you can auto a couple. He has no TP, that's, but you can auto. Oh, no, there's Vigo, there's yeah, Vigo. That's fine, Vigo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on tilt I called champions Vigo. like ridiculous names, like, like uh, Kha'Zix is, well, Kha'Zix, yeah. So. I had a coaching so client long. once that kept calling him Kha'Zix and I never forgot. Yeah, it's, it's like Ka and then Zix, the champion, I don't know. Yeah. Or, um, yeah, I don't know. I have ridiculous names. I've had 13 years to come up with ridiculous names for these guys, so. Mm, that makes sense. Okay. So, yeah, this is just be chill. Yeah. This is a chill vibe. Yeah, it's like, this is under tower, so. And then here, I would just equal out the wave. Okay. Yeah, so... I would just keep this position as long as we can, mainly because I don't feel like roaming. Like, we're way far ahead right now. So, if I was in this game, I would just be chilling out, relaxing, getting my free item, because you have access to a free item now. Because mm -hmm. you're so far ahead. The only way you mm -hmm. really lose is just by being arrogant and taking pointless trades. I can't do this. It's so much. This is so, the HUD's so small. I, I ping my old timer a lot for like, um, I'm going up. Uh, no, I'm not. I'm not. You could I'm trade, not. you could take a trade though in that spot. You could yeah, have like yeah. slapped the shit out of him for that. I didn't have my camera angled properly, so I didn't notice. Yeah. So the next uh, wave, I would just hard shove and get my item. Okay. So what I also think here is ward. Like, what no, I there's ward no need. Scenario? There's no need. Shove. No one kills you. Okay. Hard shove. No one can kill you as long as you don't queue it. Now, uh, wait, what's your item price again? Is it 900? Uh, 900 yeah, QA. Yeah, yeah, you would always queue away, though. Mm, okay. Yeah, that's fine. Dude, I can't do this. <laughs> Just you make it a little, make it a little. Yeah, there you go. If it's like really bigger, <laughs> like, yeah. we're not going to we're not going to shame you in the comments for being able or unable to click a button. Yeah, because I'm used to like, oh, I run my mouse down and it's kind of like a muscle memory to where my ult is. We're not going to shame him, right? Comments? Yeah, yeah. We're not going to make fun of him. That's fine. It's fine. <clears throat> so, yeah, you need to pull him off a tower. You have two options. Okay. You can pull him off a well, tower or you can aggressively push. I would just let him push to us. See if we can get one more all in. And if he backs down, then we hard shove and roam. Too easy. Okay. okay. Oh, I messed that up. Uh, let's see. Yeah, There's Nunu. Oh, no. Yes. All right. Shove, shove, shove. He broke your wave. Just shove. Yeah. Now roam to bottom. Quickly. Roam, 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 roam. There's Vigo. But that's fine. Wait, Turn. Wait, 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 oh, shit. We got a flash oh, out. Oh, there's Spike. I'm dead. I'm dead. Okay. Yeah, I couldn't do anything. Yeah, I was going to. So the idea was if we quickly had shoved that out, then we could have just left. Yeah. But yeah, it was kind of an unlucky timing. Oh, oh great. Yes. Okay, so hold tab. Okay, Draven's got a bounty. Aatrox has a bounty. So look at mid. You're going to miss the small wave. So I would just yeah. think, can I roam somewhere? I would roam to top to start. So cue to towards top. Wait, oh, I forgot my boots. Uh, that's important. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm ganking that guy, probably. So I see the TP here, and I think this guy's gonna back off. He like, might, he might, but you're you're Vi, you're Vi, and you're fed, and you have an item. So Q for it again, Q for it again. Go around this guy, go behind him. This is a really good look because he killed your he killed your Scion. Oh God. Oh, oh. it's Vigo, bro. What is this guy doing here? Fuck him up. Oh, what? What? 
Okay, good. <laughs> Alright, fuck this guy. Oh, uh, no, no. We can kill this dude. This, this guy's fucking dead. Okay, grab top, grab top, grab top. No, 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 you can't leave. Grab top, okay, okay. And that's... Why would I want to push my yeah, be, other lane? Keep pushing, keep pushing. Because he, he has no way to get to this wave. It's it's all gone. Just push okay. this under. Does Aatrox have TP? So he's probably yes. going to use it right here. So just push this under. Just try to shove this wave all the way up. All right, I'm taking a plate yeah. now because he, he hasn't yeah, TP. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And then I would Q away, Q away. <clears throat> to the bush usually and then just press B. In this scenario is because this guy does not get this wave at all. And right. yeah, okay. Hold the uh, tab. I think I would go. Yeah, you go uh, steel caps because of the Draven. Okay. So you have to basically itemize for the biggest threats. And in this situation, right. it's going to be Aatrox and Draven. Victor doesn't really exist to us. <clears throat> There's also a Vigo, as you're calling it. Uh, you should probably queue to top right now because none of y'all really? are catching oh, that wave. Cool. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, 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 that's one thing I really struggle with is like when other people are just in my lane, I don't know what the hell to do. Yeah, this it's is like, it. This I... is literally the answer. You just go and catch the other shit. Yeah. I mean, yeah. at this moment, Scion's coming up. So just give it a second. We can all in this guy again with Ignite. Trade him. Short trade him. Oh, uh, damn. Now run. Dance. Wiggle. I'm fire. Ugh. All right. Now Ignite. I have all. I'm just kind of bait him. Uh, Use your yeah. refills. Yeah. They're gone. All right. Okay, I didn't like that trade at all. <clears throat> okay. Um, well, can we go to yeah? Kind of camera to mid. Well, we we could talk about it more, but the idea yeah. is that you traded before you had all. There's just yeah. no point since you could just one tap him anyways. All right, shove shove mid, shove mid. Use that Q. Cool. Take a plate. Brother Vigo can come for you. Mm -hmm. So my goal Wait, here no. would be you got 10 seconds. Wait, what, what <clears throat> so I would it? kite back and I would shove the wave. So kite back and shove. Oh, okay. Quick, quick, quick. Good, That's now run. Keeping... Yeah. And what I would Q one more time so he couldn't walk forward or stop our back. Yeah, that's okay. good. Press beat. What? Uh, wait, what? Hmm. I'm so confused by this Vigo. Uh, double long. Yeah. Sorry, I was a little stumped there by the. This man bought heart steel, then sold it for. No, he didn't. Whatever. He bought no, heart steel. Look at look at my, look at the chat. Look at the chat. Vigo heart steel. That's not a buy. He was he possessed a uh, scion. Oh. Well. Yeah. All right. Noob moment. All right, I'm done. Yeah. Yeah, go kill, kill Victor. He's he's rotating back. Yeah, yeah. I don't. Yeah, okay. You can kill him. Okay, now you can't because he has vision. Yeah. Wait. Point. You're a nice guy for not clearing that pink. Uh, that's all I know. Uh, okay. Well, I don't want to get queued there. I guess is the thought. I don't know. And now it's easy. Yeah, we can clear it now. Yeah, I don't have any. I don't have anything to do here. The whole tab real quick and so we've got rift spawning i would hard shove this and then run to top so try to get rift okay. <clears throat> this okay. atrox is going to kill your whole team probably up there so okay push quick with confidence it's okay if you take a little damage just get this out of our face now run 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 to top yeah that's good to do it use your refill um, and get your camera up there oh yeah go behind it with confidence use your yes. q that's fine. We're going for Aatrox. We go hard. We go hard. Press R. Go, 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 go. <laughs> uh, we shove the wave. Shove the wave. Shove first. Shove first. This is bad. Okay. okay, okay. So I'm doing. Uh, what is this guy doing? <clears throat> He's fine. Now you can collapse down. You can collapse on him. Uh, save your queue. Don't queue into them. Just kind of walk up for now yeah. until we know what's going on. Because your friend, Vigo, brother Vigo, can show up, dude. For that pink yeah. too. Yeah. 
Yep. Uh, who's Vigo? Yeah. Uh, Science well, we CP. So yeah, if you force. You force. Right here. Go, go, go. Yeah, you force force some awkward shit. <clears throat> Oh, that's weird. Right oh, back? I don't like yeah. this. Yeah. Okay, that guy's fucking you up. So, out, yeah, yeah. Out, out. Just take a recall once we get over the wall. Oh, there's a TP. There's a TP. Ah! Ah! You gotta flash that shit. Stop yelling. I thought. Wait, you flash and then QA. Yeah. Okay. I honestly didn't think he would kill me that fast. That was that decision. Wait. Okay. Pickaxe or cloak? Pickaxe. Okay. That's what I usually do, but just wondering. Yeah, there's no reason we should die to this shit. That should have been just flash okay. away Q, and then you farm under tower, and then we were not... Mm -hmm. We're probably going to lose rifts, but we wouldn't have just given away our momentum. We gave away a lot of momentum mm -hmm. holding flash there. Mm -hmm. Stop okay. contenting us. Stop contenting the coaching. Focus up. No, 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 no. Okay, so for my flash... No, I meant the yelling. Pretty... I don't care about the flash. Oh, okay, okay. No, that's actually a normal thing. I'm sorry. Um, The... the... The um the uh, well you care about the flash but whatever yeah it's it's because I like to use it offensively so I think more like risk uh well, I, I'm risk. with you but if we drop a bounty that's yeah not good. oh okay. we could kill this guy though yeah he's out of line yeah, he's dead either way if I don't ult but I can't ult yeah we don't need to okay cool so yeah. we get third drag you can yeah, fight that yeah yeah, yeah nice nice call nice that's call. call. Okay, nice. good enough. Right. Good enough. Good enough. Cool. We push this under. Threaten to take tower. You can save your Q and just threaten to hit tower. I think this is fine. Uh, Victor's OP. Wait, what was he doing? Oh, no, not a bike. I'm fucking dead. Oh, I think in that okay. spot, turning on Aatrox is a little sus. I would rather just yeah. either Q to Victor and leave, or mm -hmm. we could just try to leave outright. Like, just Q away. Because basically, mm -hmm. you keep trying to open trade with this Aatrox going by your cloak. You gotta view him as a yeah, yeah. as a guy that that you just don't kill unless you have your full rotation. That's how I view okay. Aatrox, Renekton, shit like that. I don't ever try to full trade those unless I have everything up. Okay. I see. I I thought like I saw Varus and I was like, this guy can uh, you know uh, contribute. <laughs> yeah. No. Never. <clears throat> always play your life. Never. Never trust. Never okay. trust. Okay. Because okay, you basically, so basically, if you, if it's a situation where you're not yourself, like if you're not going to instantly pop somebody, oh, okay, wow, wow, uh, we're getting swagged on? Like, what the fuck is happening? Yeah, okay, well, what I was going to say there, I guess, is like, um, that scenario, right, I see my mid lane, or my bot lane mid, I see my jungler bot, and I see my top lane top, where the hell do I go? We go bot. Because, I go bot? Yeah, we're going bot right now, yeah. Because, like, this is pushed in my mind. We're gonna and, kill him. Uh, I see this here, and that's like, now, yeah, okay. I go here. I just press R and I win. But, um. Or Draven. <laughs> what is this guy doing? I think right, your Q, that, that was, your Q was, was very, awkward. your Q is very quick. Yeah. I would have slowed that down. Okay. Mainly because if he flashes, I want to be able to follow it. Because he's in such a shit spot there. Uh, can we afford. Our, yeah, we yeah. Like let's just recall after we clear this. Always like walk away first, then recall just for like a uh, half a second. Okay. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. Okay, okay. And then here, uh, uh, versus this comp, hold tab again. It doesn't matter because I buy long sword either yeah, way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just uh, curious. Uh, yeah, sorry. I was trying to get out of base. Um, I would say Essence Reaver in this scenario. Yes. They don't have yes. Any yes. armor. Yeah. I agree. Oh, whoa, 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 camera on that. You looked away from the good part. <clears throat> I want to see how much, uh, how low they get. Okay, I see. Um, I have Vigo here and I would just pushed, go bottom. So I would just I'm, go bottom. I just, okay. Why not just farm uh, I mean, the, next... go bottom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but, what, but I'm wondering. What is well, this okay. <clears throat> Basically, right now, you're guaranteed to kill on Draven. If he keeps doing this, you just kill him every time, right? right? right. So just wait a second and then calmly walk in with your ult. All right, now you can walk up. Okay. So you know that you get the win. What's the guy doing? Oh. That's yeah, that's that's why we were waiting, yeah. 
I can uh, just grab the wave. Ping this brand off. What the fuck is he doing? That's our wave. Q to it. All right, let's keep pushing. Keep pushing. Keep okay, pushing. Why, why would I push here as opposed to like recall? Mm -hmm. All right, look at the map. Do you die ever? Uh, maybe. I don't know where anyone and, is. Whoa, 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 how are they going to get to us? You have vision. You have vision to your left. They okay. they can't just. They're not like uh, superheroes. They can't just like fly around a bot lane, right? That's way in the middle of nowhere. They're going to give up Baron if they come down here. So you killed this guy in the corner of the map. This is post lane phase. Like bot lane doesn't exist anymore. That guy should never even be up here. Like that was crazy that he even came out this far. Let's sit back though. Sit back a little bit until we know more. Because right now the map went dark. Okay, now You're we right. see okay, that. Two, three top. Yeah, One so you can body language this or recall. Personal opinion, I would shove one more probably and then get the fuck out. Okay, now I'm getting a little spooked because the map's getting super dark. Yeah. You could try to shove it. Top. You could try to shove it. Uh, yeah. You should hit cannon first. Oh, okay. Because, yeah, he's going to contest us now. I, I think I oh my god, you could just save your Q and auto it. What the fuck? Uh, Alright, now recall. Okay, I'm just back. I'm just back. Okay, so... It's okay if you get a little low. So you'll be alright. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh, okay, that's cool. Alright, let's get back out there. Mid now, uh, I like, would go like, towards what? mid. I would go towards mid and just hover yeah. and just... You keep using your Q, though. Why aren't we queuing? Uh... Now move your so here when you when you move down mid you're just looking around okay they won that so you assist ping uh, Baron here or well dragon spawning too actually careful 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 yeah this is good this is okay this is okay and hey, we're gonna lose dragon we're gonna lose dragon but that's okay you might be able to kill Draven they split go go try to pop him real quick counter kill yeah quick ignite see if you can okay good 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 he flashed leave. As soon as you see that flash, fucking get out. Turn. Yeah. Like, just get out. It's all good. That was a perfect attempt, except you followed it up for no reason. Just let it go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I feel like I'm always, like, committed. When you don't I have to be, though. You don't have to be. Yeah. You just, you ult, and then, oh, this guy's away. I queue backwards. You can always queue backwards. That's why I was getting anxiety when you didn't just push into the victor. Because I'm like, this guy could just walk up an auto, and if it looks like mm -hmm. he's going to die, just queue away. <laughs> like limit test that shit. That's why. That's why in fights I keep uh, saying shit like hold your Q and just walk up, because yeah. sometimes the play is to literally just auto people or to ult and auto them and then Q. So I go bot because my team. Yeah. Not so Draven's here. basing, so I would go around them. I would flank because if he bases, you've got a big wide flank that you could start doing that could really fuck with, with the, them. Yeah, 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 here. yeah. Yeah. Because if they are lazy with their backs at all, you're just going to kill them. <laughs> and, um, yeah, normally I do a little better with the cues, but I'm also trying to, like, oh, whoa, what are you, what are you doing? All right, Baron, 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 Baron. Shove mid and Baron. You definitely want to go for it and pressure it right now. All right, ping the shit out of it. I can't. Um,. Yeah, usually I'm a little better with the, the cues into lane and such, but I'm trying to pay attention to what you're saying also. You're, so. you're good, you're good, uh, you're good. Yeah, yeah, sorry. This is free low. Free low. So wait, you might uh, have to turn. Okay, so ignite Aatrox if you ignite anybody. Whoa, whoa, get out of there. Get out of there. Okay, okay. Uh, okay, okay now you turn back to Baron. Sorry, but like, you have to be yeah, juggling. So what I saw there was my team was fine. If you thought, so if you thought the they won, going. I did not think they won, to be honest. Really? I, yes. Okay. I'm very scared of Aatrox ult reset there. That's what I'm afraid of. I see. Because <laughs> you have to get there and get the ignite on him. Because um, if we don't, we could lose. And then they get Baron. Um, yeah okay so but let's play this from my mind where it's like man maybe i'm stupid like i saw them winning there do i stay on baron or do i go anyways because uh, i think like, you go anyways think usually because you're not gonna be able to finish baron solo right yeah but my thought is i you're well, like I juggling it, it you're like that. juggling it for the yeah. yeah just for the tempo i get that but like you have to realize in a spot like that you had flash up so you actually do have a real play if you get over there and mm. like q flash if you didn't have a, okay. any play at all I could kind of vibe with it because you're like, ah, I'm, what am I going to do? I'm going to walk over there. They're going to walk away, right? But since you have yeah. Q flash, 
It's like an actual move. Uh, all you right. could all in this guy. Yes, you I can definitely all in him. Is. Yes, you did. You you know where Viego oh, is. You know where yes is. is. I would drop around. Go go get away from this wave and just go towards bottom. Like yeah, swing yes. down to the the lonely Draven is what I would do. Okay. Um, no, oh, no, no, no 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 the Draven. Yes. Okay, that's fine. That's a free one. Yeah. Now now get us out though because we can't. Yeah, we can't get counter killed. Yeah, this is why I'm afraid. <laughs> Oh. See, you're you're excited because you see a kill. I'm excited yeah. to go bottom because I see a kill down low where there's uh -huh. no risk. Okay. Because they're they're going for your shitty shitty ass Varus who's out of position. But guess what? Yeah. So is this whole team. Uh-huh. Okay. Draven, you have to start identifying that there's some targets that are like very low risk. And then yeah. you might be thinking like, oh, I could get this kill and that's like looks nice. But I'm accounting for rotations. Okay. Yeah, I feel like that's just like, I mean, not, not as an excuse, but I, I'm just like a pretty like risk tolerant person. So yeah. that's something to overcome. I'm like a very risk taller person, actually. Go through, go through jungle bot side, and then go into yeah. So use your Q. We're going to river, like, and then we're gonna look for a flank on somebody in mid before dragon spawns. Okay. Keep oh, using that Q. Look at this dumbass. Too. This this oh, is why I wanted to keep. This is why I wanted to go <laughs> bottom because I knew that this guy's dumb as hell. And anytime somebody's dumb as hell, you gotta exploit it. Go to bot and push this out. Yes. I do the same thing and hire elos. If somebody is like like obviously not paying attention to what they're doing i will structure every every play around them for the rest of the game okay because uh, yeah that we just take that's a free tower yeah free tower gg big gold big moolah And dragon. Uh, right. yeah, 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 yeah. Um, golems? yeah, we can take golems. I mean, your team gets dragged with ease. These guys are screwed, man. I would just take a recall and then, uh, really? yeah, yeah, you got a lot of gold. Your team has right, this. Well, GA is probably where I would go next. Uh, they don't have really? a lot of armor. Yeah, they don't have a lot of armor yeah. still. Yeah. I would just go yeah, GA no, with no. a stopwatch. Where is it? Yep. Uh, Both. Yep. There you go. Now you can dive in like a psycho. You can run it down and mid and again. I don't know what the heck to do. Like these guys are mid. Yeah, Q like Q right down mid and dive. Mid. You have a stopwatch. Okay. You run through mid like the Terminator and just dive somebody. It's just ping mid. Why do they want to back? Go top then if they get out. Okay, there you go. Yeah, dive this shit. Well, think about it. Think about it. You don't have to, but Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You have the stopwatch. Fling it. Yes. Now you can flash out. I'm fine. Hopefully. A QA, QA, then recall. Sweet. Okay. So then then that's it's so weird because it's like that's a scenario where I need to be more aggressive, more risk tolerant. But I wouldn't normally do that. Right, so. because you have the stopwatch to make a move. You're trying to break open tower. Right? On power spikes, on item spikes. The thing is, is people would get it in their head and they go, well, you know, I could just wait for a better play. But it's like, dude, you're facing a victor with like wave clear. They're farming up. Like, try to push, try to pressure. It's very, you say it's a risk. I don't even really think it's a risk. Oh, hello. Nice ignite. I agree. Very cool. Ooh, and go farm, awesome. farm for GA or something. Like, try to get to bottom. Yeah. All right. See that wave down there? That's where you're going. Yeah. Yeah. Team, please. They're fine. They're fine, hopefully. It's not bronze. Now, uh, what I would do here is just push up until we can get a GA and then snag that shit. Recall that because you got GA. Oops. Um, okay. This guy's fine. 
and then you go to Baron. Okay. Don't, um. Okay. There'll be like a oh, oh okay one one thing that I've been sucking at is warding. Like what the heck do I do with my ward? So you man? just put a ward right there on your bush to your left, and then one just make it a little small perimeter. So you could just yeah, right there is good. Yeah. Yeah. Just gotta see them coming so we can decide what we want to do. I mean here I'm just gonna fight them because you got GA. Yeah. I would ult Diego. Go, oh, oh, go and ult him right now. Go and ult him. Don't wait. Trust me. Just go find him. Yeah, go fuck with him. Say, so get out of the bush. Yeah. Was, uh, you have GA. You fight. You fight. They're dumb. They think they're winning. See? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. Just, it's so weird. Like, I'm, I'm so, like, not aggro in the wrong moments and then not... It's just, it's just, I'm literally, I'm literally just thinking in terms of like, I know they can't kill you. You have flash, you have GA, or you have flash, you have stopwatch. Yeah. Uh, back sure. up and just recall. It's, there's no need to even push. You did your job. You did your job. You, your job has been did. Uh, okay. I mean, whatever you want to buy, honestly. You could, I, uh, you could buy a fucking fairy charm for all I care. It doesn't, fucking long story, I don't know. Doesn't matter. It'll go into something. And... Yeah, Hex Drinker is looking like the best option at the moment. Yeah. Or Death Stance. Either works for me. Yeah. Usually here, I'll go one of those two. But I also won't have GA. And usually people with armor, so I build like Last Whisper or something similar. But yeah, whatever. Long Sword is the only thing I really. Because okay. it gives me options. Uh, okay. Camera, camera. Yeah, here, I don't know what the heck Yeah, yeah. Huh? So you'd hover bottom. You'd hover bottom and chip away. So Q over this back, yeah, yeah, Q towards bottom and let's just chip away at bot. Try to like poke the tower a bit and I don't think you're going to end the game quite yet. I don't yeah. think we'll have time for two games today, brother, sorry. It's fine. Um, I mean, we can go over more stuff yeah, because yeah, like yeah. the bot review earlier was great for me and um... Alright, sit on it, back it, and just buff this min buff these minions. When your team's yeah. near, like, you could ult when your team's near, but understand that, like, you don't have a GA, you don't have a stopwatch. So it's very, yeah. like, you just have oh, to make sure right. to make the right calls. Yeah, this is free, though. Oh, I missed. I missed. That's good. Just hover the minions and chill. What is this? What is, what is go this go for it. Guard your wave. No! You can't give oh. them the wave! There you go. Uh, like, should I go in there? I was okay with, I was okay oh, with okay. going in there, but uh, it's fine. Mm. And now it's a quick back. pop. Oh. Yeah, yeah. You would hover and recall. Okay. Okay. Yeah. It's it's these scenarios in late game where I really don't know what to do because I don't know what to base it on. Hex drinker here. It's a better buy. Yeah. Yeah. So it's just because you um because you guys have Baron. As long as you're getting like one pick and like surviving, that's always fine. Like if you get a pick and recall yes. and come back out, it's always good. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I I, I get there's not time for another game, but I think like yeah, yeah. we can vod a bit. Scenarios would be very useful. Yeah, we could do some vod. <clears throat> no, that's that's probably good. Um, let's look at some of those uh, spots and talk about those. Yeah. Mainly the Draven Death. I want you to look. All right, so. Let's talk about this. So you bump into Viego and he fucking chunks you. And then you're running away. And then you're still running away. You see the you see the TP. Now, this is the problem. Is that at this moment, oh, well, actually, I'm amazed you don't have a bounty, but you probably should usually. In my head, you're in control of the game right now. You are yes. the carry. So you need to flash out here and keep momentum. Flash for TP is a perfectly acceptable trade. There's nothing wrong with that. Obviously, flash costs a little bit more, but that's completely okay when you get TP'd on. Okay. So, like, if you see a TP and it's gross, like, this one is gross because he's in, he's basically on us, right? <laughs> we have to flash out here. You hold it. If you had just flashed out and queued, this would have been A-OK. -okay. You would have kept your okay. momentum because I want games where we're, like, 10 and 0, oh, 10 and 1, 10 and 2. All right, okay. or less kills, less deaths. I'm okay with that. When you are trade, when you are learning, when you are learning how to like get up past gold, you need to be you you 
you can't just throw up your hands and be like, fuck it, I'm trading. Like, that's not good. Yeah. You understand? With the trade of, of resources slash summoner spells here is good because I have an advantage. So it's good because, yes, you guys had just won a fight before. Um, let me back up a bit to the whole sequence. It's hard to like frame these up in the heat of the moment, but like, here's the example. So you shove mid out. I say, okay, let's just roam because there's two top and you have ult and you're not going to do anything versus Victor, right? You're not just going to cold yes. dive him. So we're Vi. Let's use our good wave clear and our, in our uh, roam here and get something done. So you run to top and then you're like, all right, cool. I'm going to ult this guy. Sion gets to punch the shit out of him. And then you get the kill. At this point, I say, all right, cool. Let's shove the wave. And then I have you run back towards... Well, technically, I could have had you recall here, if I'm being honest. And yeah. I might have been able to actually have you take tower too, maybe, if we'd rushed it. But the point is... Oh, yeah, Sign was TPing, so it got weird. We just... It, the replay was bugged. So Sign was TPing, so it was like, all right, let's look at this fight. And what I was thinking in my head is just hold your Q and just see what gets... See what sets up. So Viego turns on you, so now you Q away. At this point, you had made a successful gank, you made a successful roam, and all is well in the world. If you flash out and recall, that's, that is favorable for you. Uh -huh. But you're saying, you're asking basically whether or not the sums are traded, if that's like, if it's because it's worth it. Sh the long story short is, yes, it is worth it because they're pulling their whole team towards top side. There's nothing that they're going to really get done, even if they kill you. Um, or I'm sorry, there's nothing that they're going to get done if you flash out. Except maybe take this top tower. Does that make sense? Yeah. They're so ahead, I technically. Consider, like, the past actions as well. Yeah, they're, yes, they're ahead, technically. So they are yeah. going to take top tower. But, like, you are, you've got a lot of agency. I guess what it boils down to is it's not whether or not you're winning. You are winning. Your team is winning or losing. It's whether or not you have agency. And right now, yeah. if you just get the fuck out, and keep us going, you're going to be able to recall, farm mid, keep getting bigger, and stay ahead of the, the curve, the power curve. When you okay. die, you give everybody the opportunity to catch up to you. It has nothing to do whether or not your team's winning or losing. We're just playing a game with some cards, and we just want to retain the amount, or the maximum amount of, of influence, and, and exert the maximum amount of control over the game that we possibly can. You understand? So it's all about me, basically. It is. It is. And it sounds <laughs> yeah. really douchey. And it's really bad because it's a team game. But guess what? The the At the end of the day, I view it like everybody in this lobby has an equal opportunity at the start of the game to practice whatever the, it is their champion does. I have guided you through the lane phase and good back timings. And we've gotten a lead. Maintain your lead at all costs because while you may be thinking, oh, death's not that bad. I get home guards out of base. I'm only dead for a little bit. I keep flash or whatever. I'm telling you that if you don't, if you just quickly get out and recall, you could be on the map farming and that's always going to put you further ahead than dying here. Aside from the fact that you give them gold, you give them time to push waves in safely and not worry about you and you stop gaining gold and XP in that duration. <laughs> it's literally just like jungle pathing in a way. Um, like where I tell people like, yo, you got to kite the camps. You yeah. can make the argument that like, oh, I don't have to kite the camps. But like, if you're saving 20 seconds, that's time that you could be on the map. Getting a, yeah. uh, catching a wave, finding a play. Do you see where I'm going with this? That's why this yeah. death, even though like deaths don't seem that consequential sometimes, you're on a 36 second timer. How long do you think it would take you to to flash and queue out and recall and then get back on the map? Do you think it would take 36 seconds to get no, to do all that? Like 15, max, 20? 15, yeah. Maybe, yeah. depending on if they stop our back. Well, guess what? You just saved 15 seconds to eat a wave, yeah. be in, get yourself into position before the next situation. So it's yeah. like, and that's not even to include the gold that you bounce and the XP that you bounce to the other team. Yeah. That's the kicker there. Is you're giving them you're giving them ground as well. And guess what that ground means? They push faster. They rotate faster. Do you see what I'm trying to trying to say? Yeah. It's like it all adds up. It's like um it's like the butterfly effect, you know? League is just kind of an example of like the butterfly effect in that in that regard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I told yeah, this is actually extremely useful because like I always get stuck 
like right up on tower because of something I do. So yeah. If you get the kill, immediate, yeah. as soon as you get the kill, look at the wave and say, can I quickly shove this or is it pushing to me? If it's pushing to you, start considering as soon as you get the kill, duck behind the minions and just recall. Got it? Okay. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, this is very helpful. Good. I have to get ready for the next one. Um, sorry yeah. that I was delayed again. I made up for the time. Um, All good. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, man, this was fun. I, this was this was a really good. This was a good, good, good session. I appreciate it. I know I yelled at you a little bit for being too tomfoolery, nah, but fine. <laughs> this was. I think this was really good. Shoot me a message in a couple weeks. Your homework. Show me you doing this on your own. Clip. Okay. You get a kill. You assess the wave. You realize I could back and receive the wave more safely. Start with that. If you can execute it in a game and demonstrate that you understand when you're supposed to do it then okay. you've changed your game fundamentally and now you'll hopefully unlock some more rank off of that. Got it? Okay. Cool. cool. Yeah, thank you so thank much you. for the support, man. I appreciate it. For sure. Thank you. Peace, buddy. All right, guys. What'd you think? Did, did Angle... Did he... Did he... Uh, did he have a good day or not? I think it was good coach. He, he was good enough at his champion, too, to where he uh, got himself good little momentum in the early so that he could, like, make an actionable like an actionable coaching session off of the situation. So he's a good sport. He ran into some good spots. That was great. Um, as always, if you like my coaching, the like button, the share buttons, click your buttons. I am going to bounce. And for the stream, I'll be back in about 10 minutes for another one. Uh, I'll see you guys in a bit on the research. <laughs>